And see y'all, see when I was saying y'all gotta trust the process, cause, mmm, mmm, trust the process, baby. <sighs> I like this look though. Now I gotta FaceTime people and just be like, so they can say, oh, you look pretty now. beautiful butterflies and cow pillars. hey what's up so i'm coming to you with a makeup tutorial i've seen this creative idea on i think on instagram somebody tagged me into it and it made me it made me want to do it oh max um it made me want to do it it's a very nice look let's look at it real quick Let's look at it. And you know, I'm going to put my own little specialty with it. I'm not. You see? You know what? Matter of fact, I'm going to throw it up too. I'm going to throw it up on the thing. So I'm going to try this. Right? And we're going to see how it come out. Because it looks real good. I like it. Like, it's, it's the detail for me. Like, let's do this. Okay. Um. Yeah, we got to do that. It looks real good though. So it's who is it? I am Hunt. I am, I am Shantae Slay. I am Shantae Slays. I am Shantae Slays. I guess that's what her name is. But yeah, she killed this makeup look. So let's do it. So first, I start off with a full. I'm going to do, like, my foundation and everything first, then do the eye design, you know. I think that might be easier. So, if y'all want to see me do, like, a whole video of me breaking down my makeup, like, what products I use and, like, my process, let me know. Drop the comments down below so I can show y'all, okay? And make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment, and follow me on Instagram, TikTok, everywhere, okay? I need to change all my platforms to It's Hot Wheels. I'm going to do that. It's Nichelle Hot Wheels. <laughs> all right, so y'all, let's get into it. So, let me sit on my... I got to get my... Oh, uh. So, this is how I like to set it up so I can see. Now, and I got my little coffee. It's going to be good. I'm going to go live, too. Let me turn on this light right here. Go live on that thing. Oh, shit. Now that I'm about to break some. All right. There goes some more light for y'all. Could have put a little uh in it. I'm going to do that TikTok today where it be like, um, 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 I just learned that last night. So, anyway, y'all, let me get to it. This is probably what take me so long. So, okay. For those colors, right? Because I ain't know, like, like what those colors is, right? So, I'm going to do this palette. This is this is one of my favorite palettes right here. I'm not going to even lie. It's the um the Morphe. But who, who is the Morphe something? That girl, I don't know her name. But Annabelle Grit. Y'all see that? Morphe. Alright. I love this little palette. Y'all see it's so many different eyeshadows that's already out of it. I didn't use this. I didn't use this thing, right? And this, y'all. This is one of my first palettes that I ever got off Amazon. Like, um. I would say the colors are not as pigmented as maybe like Morphe, but it's my first palette, like my first palette I ever bought. Like you always gotta keep it, you always bring it around. And it it has like some subtleties, 
So, and I ain't gonna lie, this don't blend that well. So you definitely gotta have good technique freaking with this palette. But for the most part, yeah, you gotta keep going in and blending in, yeah, because it's not that pigmented whatever but it does get the trick done my big it gets it done so y'all clearly see i didn't use the blue up a good bit but i didn't have this palette over two years so i ain't gonna lie and it's it, it's still it's still working for me it's i like it now this is one of my other favorite ones it's the jacqueline hill morphe i see i got a lot by morphe i see okay so because i be going to Ulta a lot also in sephora but I love this one right here because it's like all the neutral colors. I love this one. Like the it be the neutral colors for me. It's the oranges. Like the oranges. You know. Mm, yeah, I love this one. It's the oranges, the red. When I do my red lip, I use this palette too. And you know, when I do like wet and stuff i like this palette but i also use a different palette too for wigs or whatever so but i love this one i love this one it's the colors for me the purples and the pinks and just everything like do you see this yeah i love it anyways jack and hill so of different ones from them and they do all loose and that is very pigmented because look let me open it you see that? Like, right. it, it, look, I just touch it. Pigmented, okay? You just touch it and it's there. So, now let's get into this makeup look. So, let's start off with primer. Be hitting. Okay, let's do this. And why do we use primer? Like you use primer because primer helps your foundation and your concealer, everything stay in one spot, and it gives it that um inviting welcome that makeup needs on that skin, right? Ooh, ooh, right? Ooh. And I already did my skincare routine this morning, so like. I do my cleanser, toner, um, what you call it, um, moisturizer, and sunscreen. Yeah, so that's all. All right, boom. Now, I don't got my favorite eyebrow pencil right now because it is out. This is my favorite eyebrow pencil, y'all. It just be giving. It be giving, but I don't, it's out. So I've been using my other one. What's this one? This is something you can get from the drugstore that I got like a long time ago and it's still holding in a, where you at, grab? Drugstore. See, so this one right here was $2. This right here, $20. It do the same thing though. Who is? Oh, I ain't no lucky. I thought I did. I'm not. Yeah, yo, that was my cousin who came in. Yeah. <laughs> no, um, I'm doing a video for my YouTube. Oh. Hey, YouTube. They can't even see you Friday. Yeah. The camera right here, bro. I know. Oh. <laughs> yes, y'all. My kids is it. Is it? I'm doing a um makeup one today. What's up, y'all? So, I'm just talk about what I'm doing in the video. Why it's going real fast, you know. I can't take myself seriously. Either. So, what I like to do is I like to go into with the brows first and fill them out as good as I want to because I feel like brows take the most time. So, I like to take my time on my brows, perfect them exactly like I want them. Then I can start doing everything else, you feel me? But you got to get them brows right. So, do y'all see how I put the light under and then on top I put like more of a warm. So, okay. So, that's what I do. So, under the brows I do like two shades lighter than me and then the other one I do one shade lighter than me on the top part. But y'all see I be going crazy. And when I blend I just pat, 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 pat,
And then when you get to the tip, you smothered it. You see that thing? Hold on. Do I need to slow down? All right. Mm-hmm. So then you slow it down, then you blend, 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 blend. I'm telling you, you gotta, you gotta beat that thing, baby. You gotta blend. That's why people be saying beat. I was wondering when they be like, oh, beat my face. I was wondering why people were saying that, but I see why now because we be like tapping and beating on the face. Got you. I'm getting it now. Anyways. So now you see, I just put Casilla on my lid. I know other people put like the lid primer, but I still put Casilla on there because cares he still does the same thing now if i want a different pigment sometimes i do use the the one because i do have eyelid primer except for this one so i mean it's whatever folks your boot so now y'all see i'm blending in with my foundation because i'm done with my eyes now so now i can put my foundation on and i like to just be in it all into the face i like to blend my brows blend my foundation into everything and then i like to do my baby hairs next because you know like i had my baby hairs to smother through my um what's that junk called i hate it to smother through my foundation so i just put a little bit of foundation on then go in with my baby hairs because i don't want to put too much product and then you see the product in the damn edge control that's no i'm not trying to do that we ain't going casper we're not going casper Okay. Now y'all see afterwards. As I get that little slip, sip, sip, I had to put that, lay that thing down with that lace band, okay? Because, yes, them, them baby hairs be swimming, right? Now, I'm going back in on my foundation. I'm going in my concealer. Look, concealer always going to places that you want to hot or that you want to end frizz of. I don't know what that thing is. But y'all know when you want your eyes to blend and you want to get rid of the dark marks, so... Yo, concealer always go on your dark marks. And then you blend the concealer out into the foundation. That's how you don't have harsh lines. You always want your foundation to start off strong. So when you put your powders on, nothing will stand out too harshly. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? I don't know what you know. But I, you know what I mean. Okay. So y'all see me blending in with the powders and you see what powders do powders just give it that more natural feel and it it takes the shine down so that's why people be like do you have to with the powder yes you have to with the powder the powder has to go on y'all see me you see how you gotta turn you gotta warm yourself up back with that um what you call it bronzer okay i don't contour i just bronzer i feel like it's the same thing one day i might contour and then bronzer and see what's the difference because i mean i guess i see the difference but i don't think it's no difference you can do either one anyways but you see we have to warm up that face and what i do with my baby hairs i like them so they can last all day i put like that got to be glue on here and yeah that thing be stealing them concealing them getting them that are room all that because it be like staying all day okay and then i probably gotta put some water on it and make sure like you know no white stuff come out of it and stuff like that like i don't, I don't want my baby has to be having white stuff in me you know what i mean and anyways i don't know what i'm doing right now like i think i'm just looking at the pictures Boom. Can y'all see me? I think so. Alright, okay, come on. So, 
and lift it up like this. Uh, Cause you get more oil when you do that. Okay. So that's the first one. That's a, uh, uh. I can't take my sister here. I already can't. Okay, so that one. Uh, uh, there you go. Okay, ooh, I don't like that one. Okay, we can do better. So we turn it in. Okay, uh, 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 uh. Okay, there we go. So you see, you have to keep going over the eyeshadows to make sure that like the pigment comes out the way you want it to. And then of course you want the the dark to infuse into the the light green. So you want to just make sure that you keep going in and blending it because you don't want to see skin. You want to see nothing but eyeshadow. So you see, I'm going in with a light color and then I'm going into the middle with the medium color. So I went in with the light to just lay it down and then I went in with the medium color in between the shades to blend it in more. And then you got to go back over with the colors until everything is blended exactly how you want it to. So you got to just keep playing with it, keep playing with it and do it into your perfection. You know, this was mine. Like I like to do dark to real light and then i do the medium and then i'll probably do dark medium then light because it's like it's all about your blending skills all about your blending skills and now i gotta put this white line to see like you don't, your brush placement and the type of brush you have is so true and with white liner you have to keep going back in and dipping into the brush because you don't want the white liner to smudge into the colors and then the colors is on the white liner you know what i mean so yeah you always gotta make sure you go back and dip you know what i mean because you don't want everything to look together you want the white lines to be white not green not to grin so yeah you see and you want to take your time with this because it's like tracing so you want to make sure you take your time go back into it thicken the line make the line more wider whatever you got to to give it that illusion you're giving illusion people be wondering how long this stuff be taking it be like i could do this with hours and hours and hours i could do this for hours but no for real though i mean it just as long as you take your time the better you get but y'all see how i'm putting white at the bottom i don't even know what i use i think i use just like the paint stuff i was using yellow i wanted to put white at the bottom lashes i don't know it was just giving it so why not put the white on the bottom okay 
Anyways, now y'all see I gotta put the diamonds on here. The diamonds. Which I need me a wax stick. Because I noticed that them wax girls, when they be having like them nail stuff, them things, like, like it picks the diamonds up way better. Like with me, I just be putting glue at the back of my um brush stick. And then just, you know, do what to do. That's what I do. Well, right here, y'all see I got the the tweezers because the diamonds was on something else so it was more easy to do it with the tweezers this time now it's time to lay them lashes down like i put the guy on what you call it the dual glue my hunger and them talking about you expensive because it's six dollars them six dollars is worth it because that thing be like a magnet them lashes just sit on that but you i'm gonna let that glue down freeze up and then you know you see how i did that line of that lip i like to overline my lips a little bit give it that selena vibes baby giving them things puffy i'm giving puffy baby now i put them lashes on. i love them lashes. i get them lashes from the flea market I love the flea market. I think she get it from Wish. Wish list, Amazon, um, them bundle deal places. I just like to see my stuff in real life. That's why. But y'all yeah, see what I do with my lip is I like to fill it in and then I like to go back over it with powders because I just make my, it make my lip last like all day. Like I'm talking about eating chicken in the restaurant, smacking, and I'm looking good on my mama, on my food. I look fly. I look good. Now let's put this lip gloss on. Let's see what I'm looking like. Let's see what I'm looking like. Oh, excuse me. What happened? You scared the fuck out of me. What what she do? Damn. Damn. What is it? Two face? What the hell? I just look. I like it. What y'all think? Drop the comments below. Y'all like <laughs> Yes, but anyways, drop your likes, your comments, and subscribe, like, comment, you know. If y'all want to see me, you know, talk about products more, and anything you want to see, let me know. I'm here for you. You are here for me. See y'all in the next video. Now let's do some TikTok. So make sure y'all go follow me on TikTok and Instagram so y'all can see these videos. I'm about to drop on my pretty first. You feel me? Okay. All right. And it, it is, it's Hot Wheels, Michelle. It's Michelle Hot Wheels. Yeah, I need to know my own tag. I'm wrong for that. It's Michelle Hot Wheels. Hold on. It's Michelle. It's Michelle Hotwood. See you in the next video. Peace. And hey, see y'all, see when I was saying y'all gotta trust the process, cause, mmm, mmm, trust the process, baby. <laughs> I like this look though. Now I gotta FaceTime people and just be like, so they can say, oh, you look pretty. And then hang up, call somebody else. You look pretty. Hang up, call somebody else. <laughs> See y'all later.